The WRC2 Championship arrived at Rally RACC Catalonia, Rally de España, with Pontus Tiedemann already crowned champion. But there was still plenty of drama to be had as Takamoto Katsushu broke his steering in the first 5k of the opening stage. Fabio and Delphi also went off in the same corner but never made it back onto the stage. Both drivers were forced to retire. With Tiedemann champion Jan Kopecki and Timo Sonnen have found themselves in a battle for runner-up spot. Kopecki wasn't helping his quest when he caught privateer Jordan Senderidis. The Czech driver was forced to stop in stage three because the dust was so bad. Almost a minute was lost. With over a minute lost, Italian driver Simone Tempestini was able to sneak past and claim second place ahead of Kopecki. There was a late glimmer of hope for Kopecki when Sunnan's power steering failed in the final stage of the day, costing the Finn 23 seconds. Day two, and it was time to change from gravel to tarmac for the WRC2 drivers. Simone Tempestini began the day second overall, but late drama saw him check into the final stage a minute early, earning him a one-minute penalty that dropped him to fifth. That handed Benito Guerra third place. Despite the Mexican suffering a bout of flu, he finished 47 seconds ahead of fourth place. Jan Kopecki had a storming day. The Czech driver won all seven stages as he tried to hunt down the rival, Timo Sonnen. Sonnen began the day almost a minute and 20 ahead of Kopecki. The Finn felt he had been two quarters in the morning loop, but still managed to restrict the damage to the flying Kopecki. But at the end of the day, his lead was down to 44 seconds. So the final day, and with six stages and no service, this was the longest loop of the rally. The day began with Benito Guerra defending third position, the Mexican driver holding on to record his best result of the season so far. Jan Kopecki came in today 44 seconds off the lead, having won all seven stages the day before. He followed up with another six-stage wins today as he tried to hunt down his rival, Teemo Sunanen. Sunnan, however, wasn't to be denied his first tarmac win in the WRC2 category. He matched Kopecki's pace all day to finish with the lead of over 30 seconds. So confirmation there of Sunnan's victory. Kopecki second, Guerra in third, Nogra in fourth, with Tempestini in fifth. After all of that, Sunnan and Kopecki now both have 85 points with one rally to go. Sunnan staying ahead, courtesy of one more second place finish.